Eitz Chaim was founded in 1988 by Rabbi David Wax, who partnered with Rabbi Moshe Unger to spread the light of Torah across the region. We started in this very room I'm sitting in right now in 1988, that I gave a class in learning how to read Hebrew, and Rabbi Moshe Unger gave a class in Jewish philosophy. We educated many, many, many people. Towards the end of the 20th century, Rav Noah Weinberg was a leading figure in Jewish outreach and encouraged his students to open branches across North America. If one man can kill six million Jews, one man can save six million Jews. Ace Philadelphia was founded in 1994 by Dr. Herb Kasky together with the Stern, Barnett, and Traeger families. Anyone can count the seeds in an apple, but no one can count the amount of apples that come out of a single seed. And I think that's what Aish has done over the last 25 years. We planted seeds. In 2018, efforts were made to bring these two organizations together under one umbrella. We could not be happier to have brought these two communities together, these like-minded organizations. If we can, let's try to work together. And in January of 2019, H. Chaim was born. Through an array of classes and events, there's something for everyone at H. Chaim. The strength of two organizations coming together as one has been immense. We're so overwhelmed and grateful with the wide and deep community support that we've received over the past year. Engaging, inspiring, community, friendship, evolving, engaging, giving. H. Chaim is a central part of our Jewish journey because I have a lot of gaps in my Jewish knowledge and education. I've gained a lot of inspiration from the classes. I've Doing Juba, I'm able to have important conversations about Perkei Avot with a local rabbi and have those discussions about how it impacts my life. Everyone that's involved in the organization has made such a big impact in the lives of families in the community. I can have a very personal relationship with my Judaism, and that's the biggest gift that keeps giving. Eish Chaim makes shul, going to shul fun again. Eish Chaim is a very, very special place. When I arrive there, I feel like I'm home. I truly feel like Eish Chaim is our, our second home in a way. The education that I'm getting and the classes I'm taking and the services that I go to are, are informing. And the experience uh, has been unbelievably life-changing. On um, Timbal Astora, having my Wolner on my shoulders and just celebrating that. The role of Ish Chaim in the community more than anything else is that it is the type of organization that allows people to meet on their own terms. We've sent in the past year and a half over 150 different people to Israel, affecting every single family in such a profound way. I was hesitant at first to be bar mitzvah on top of Masada, and uh, I'm so glad I changed my mind because that was uh, it was just great. It was really, really great. I didn't think I'd be able to make it to the ball this year, uh, to make it to Israel at all. And it's just amazing just to be back, back home. where we expect and anticipate even greater things. H. Chaim and H. Philadelphia, come on to H. Chaim and H. Philadelphia. We are so excited to have partnered with H. Chaim. I know, I keep doing that. Sorry, H. Chaim and H. Philadelphia, have come on to get. שמעתי שהתחלתם בלעדיי, אף אחד לא עושה את זה יותר טוב ממני, היי, הראש כבר מסתובב כולם בהיי, לא נעצור עד שכולכם מג'נונים. להיט, תרימו לי להיט, תרימו לב עולה, הקצב כאן עולה, מהפכה של צמחי. See you at a time.